welcome back to my channel. My name is Asia Aquiel if you're new here and if you are not, welcome back. Today I believe we are talking about the most important topic and that is valuing yourself. Without valuing yourself, there is no self-love, there is no healthy relationships. So do you value yourself? Let's talk about the importance of valuing yourself and how to help you start valuing yourself. Okay, so the first step to valuing yourself is knowing who you are and knowing who you are not. In your life, there might be a certain point where you think you know yourself and then life knocks you down again and again. You start to forget you are of high value and you forget who you are. Who am I? It's a question that we often ask ourselves a lot, but valuing yourself will allow you to remember. How do you know who you are? Think about what makes you happy. What do you like to do and what don't you like to do? Read self-help books such as The Secret. Out of all the self-help books I've read, this one is definitely my favorite. Most of the time if you say, oh, I wish I was a reader or I need to start working out, that means that those are underlying things that you want to be in your life, that you believe to be you or your future self. So in order to find out who you are, you really have to do the work and start doing things that you believe is who you are, that you believe is what you want to become. So really just start to do the work and start to work towards being who you believe you are. We forget who we are simply because we are disappointed in ourselves or we are not where we want to be in life in order to have compassion and what I mean by that is you have to forgive yourself for all of the mistakes that you have made don't be hard on yourself if someone that you knew or someone that you were close to was going through something hard what would you do you would have compassion for them so you have to show yourself the same compassion that you would show to others because you are the most important person in your life. Without valuing yourself, you can't have those good relationships, those healthy relationships. You can't build someone up if you can't even build yourself up. You deserve forgiveness. So learn the art of letting go and learn the art of moving forward because you deserve the happy life that is after all of that. And trust me, it is after all of that, I promise. Don't be afraid to be yourself. This one, it sounds like it should be simple, but a lot of the times it's hard to be ourselves around people that we just meet. And it's sometimes hard to be yourself when you don't know who you are. Really just learn about yourself and be authentic in how you handle negativity and how you handle positivity. If somebody does something to you and you retaliate and you look back on it and be like, why did I even do that? I'm not that type of person. Really just be authentic and know that you are better than negative energy so don't allow yourself to go down to a level that is not you because you are the only you you're the only person like you and that is a real true power just exude the essence of who you are be joyful god wants us to be joyful he doesn't want us to worry he doesn't want us to be sad and mad he wants us to be joyful so really practice being joyful laughing and loving who you are finding that out who am i be authentic all right so number four is know what is toxic this one is so important so i'm in my 20s um i don't know if you guys know when you're in your 20s that's when you lose the most friends that's when you also gain a lot of lifelong friends that's when you learn the most about yourself relationships are the number one thing to bring toxic energy to your life and with relationships comes love so a lot of the time it's hard to say no i'm not gonna take this negative energy because i love this person and love can even make you blind to the fact that it's toxic anything in your life keeps you from having peace in your heart if anything makes you forget or lose your value forget your worth then that is toxic you deserve better you deserve peace of mind you deserve peace in your life you deserve a love that lifts you up never settle for anything less because you are of high value you deserve the best love the best friendships the best 
everything. Even if in this moment you don't see it, you are a very valuable person. Don't ever forget that you are worth everything that you want, everything you desire, you are worth that. All right, and lastly, work towards what you want in life. Really set goals and work to achieve those things. It's proven that when you achieve things, it boosts your happiness, it helps make you happy. Now, it's not guaranteed. A lot of rich people are not happy. So really just aim to make yourself proud and not rich or not successful really just aim to make yourself proud in whatever way that is so set goals with whatever you want if you're wanting a relationship work to make yourself happy first um that's the only way to really work towards being in a relationship if that's what you want a lot of people say two halves don't make a whole really don't depend on somebody else even if it's your friends even if it's your family or wanting a relationship don't depend on anybody else to make you happy because that is selfish and that is not healthy and in the end they they can't make you happy only you can make you happy so really work on being a whole person by yourself not a half of a person connecting with another half be a whole person first if you want a certain job or career look at the people that have those jobs and careers and see what they have done set goals and work to achieve them always just move ahead and always just keep your head up and keep moving forward thank you guys so much for watching this video and stopping by please don't forget to subscribe if you're not subscribed already i make videos every wednesday and every sunday thank you so much for joining if this helped you give this a big thumbs up now i have struggled a lot valuing myself if you want to hear my story on valuing myself leave a comment below like this video and i'll see you guys wednesday bye